In today's video, I'm going to show you how to boost your FPS, fix FPS drops and stutters in all the games with your any low-end or modern PC or laptop. Guys, welcome into my channel and if it's your first time here, so please make sure to subscribe, turn on the bell notification, drop a like on this video. So let's go straight into over this video. So guys, in the first step, you need to press Windows R together from your keyboard and you will go to this kind of window and you need to type here gpla.msc and click here on this OK button. You will go to this kind of the window for the local group policy editor. From here, guys, you need to go for the computer configuration administrator template windows components and guys here you will find out this app privacy option open up this one and guys here on this last you will find out let's window app run into the background you need to double click here you will go to this window you need to set this option on to the enable and from here guys you need to go for the default for all apps and set it for the force deny and hit apply and click ok now guys in the second step i'm going to show you how you can boost your fps with ultimate windows optimizations pack which you can guys easily download from descriptions link down there of my this video simply open the link from description center that will take you here onto my this website here you will find out this fortnite how to get better fps on low and pc boost performance you can also scroll down and here into the recent post you will find out this kind of the post with the same thumbnail of my this video now click here on this article scroll all the way down and here you will find out this download button click on this download button and download this pack from the google drive so guys after downloading this file you will go to this kind of the winrar or zip file on your computer now what you need to do is you need to simply right click here click here onto this show more option go into the winrar option and click here extract here guys you will go to this kind of the folder on your computer which is the ultimate windows tweaker open up this folder it is bunch of file but here is the ultimate windows tweaker 4.8.exe file you need to double click here guys you will go to this kind of the interface but guys before using the software i recommend you to create a restore point on your computer so guys for creating a restore point click here on this create system restore point once you click here you will go to this kind of the window first of all you need to go for this configurations button and make sure to turn on the system protection for creating the restore point on your computer set this max usage onto 7 percent hit apply and click ok now go for this create button and simply type here windows tweaker restore point or you can name this anything click here on this create button and create this restore point on your computer so once you guys create a restore point on your computer now first of all you need to go for this performance option into the software and now you need to follow exactly every settings which i'm going to show you so guys first of all you can check it out here by default this auto and non-responsive program check this box restart shell automatically after some error also check mark here check mark on the disable smooth scrolling and also check mark on the disable edge tab preloading and also check mark on the increased priority of the ir u8 guys once you check mark on this option here on the right side you will find out the disable super fast service guys click here and check mark on this box now go for this disable tablet input service now also check mark here and guys at the last here is the disable microsoft edge preloading also check mark here once you guys done with the settings now you need to go for this next option which is the security and the privacy so here into the security option guys you need to guys now follow exactly everything which i'm going to show you now guys here go for this windows tab and from here guys you need to just simply check mark here on the disable one drive from your computer once you guys check mark here now you need to go for the next option which is the privacy and from here you need to check mark on all of these boxes first disable telemetry disable biometric disable and reset advertisement id disable handwriting data sharing disable taskbar bing web search disable cortana and disable wi-fi sense from your computer if you are using the wi-fi so guys uncheck this box and on the right side guys you will find out disable windows update sharing disable windows feedback request so guys once you're done with all of the settings now go for the next option which is the additional tab and you need to click here and now again you need to follow exactly everything which you are watching here on my screen guys you need to exactly follow all of the settings on your computer same to same and once you guys are done with all of the settings now you need to click here on this apply tweaks button and guys it will apply this tweak on your computer and now you need to click here on this close button and it will ask you for restart your computer to applying the settings on your computer and i also recommend you to guys keep this program on your computer for the future because this is one of the best windows optimizer if you want to improve the performance of your pc so guys now in the last step i'm going to show you some advanced settings for your fortnite so what you need to do you need to open up the file explorer on your windows and go for the drive where you install your fortnite most of people and by default epic games install it in your local dixie so open up this drive go for program file find out 
out here the epic game folder go into the fortnite folder go for fortnite games binary with 34 and it will take you here into the main directory of the fortnite once you are here you need to guys scroll all the way down and here you will find out this 4 exe file of the fortnite now what you need to do is you need to right click here onto the one by one go for the more option Go to the properties now go for the compatibility tab and guys disable the full screen optimization now hit apply and click ok and do the same stuff with all these fortnite exe files on your computer so guys once you're done with all of the settings now one time restart your computer then launch it back and enjoy the best performance out of your pc in any game whatever you want to play so guys i hope so you love it so please make sure to subscribe turn on the bell notification leave a like on this video so till the next video peace out